what's up guys lost tourist here and today I want to share with you what I found at a local discount department store hey everyone lost tourist here so the other day I was in a local department store it was a like a Kmart style store just a it was actually giant tiger here in Canada and uh, we were checking out uh, we're on the way and we were out to, we bought our we picked up a few things and we were in the checkout line and then I happened to glance over to the side and I something caught my eye and it was a whole display or a whole shelf full of different types of VR goggles and uh, so naturally I was uh, interested and I thought <laughs> well, I got to go look at them. And there was a bunch of them, like I said, and they're ranging anywhere from uh, $25 up to uh, $30, I think, was the most expensive. Now, this one I picked up for $25 Canadian dollars, and it said on the sticker, suggested retail $44. But I know I've seen these online for around $18 in the States. But I decided on this uh, the Dream Vision by Tazumi, and uh, a couple of things that I liked about this one. There's another one there called uh, Cyno Vision or Cyclone Vision or something like that, as seen on TV. That one had a remote, and I was kind of interested in that one. But I decided to pick this one up. I, I don't know. It's uh, the, oh, it's because it has the uh, uh, its own earbuds on this one. Now I did see someone else post a video about how those really suck but oh well I got this one anyway the packaging on this thing looks very professional anyway let's do an unboxing and see what it looks like I came prepared today I have actually got a knife not like the last boxing, unboxing that I did and uh, let's see what's in here so inside pretty cool eh? a nice carry tote bag I've been wanting to get into this thing and uh, I'm wanting to i am actually been looking for a new computer because mine's dying and uh, the ones I'm considering I'm considering that I want it to be VR ready but I know the price of those VR sets so I thought you know I might as well just kind of try it out first with a smartphone. You know, it looks, but here it is. It is pretty decent. Comes with a cleaning cloth, some rubber pads, probably for the phone. Anything else in the box? Nope. And it feels pretty solid. It's got, uh, decent amount of cushion right there and the straps look pretty decent I know the guy I saw a review of didn't like it because he said this thing kept coming off the, the goggle but it looks like it should be all right and this particular model says like it works with Google Cardboard and uh, other it works with all VR apps and this is for this is going to be used with my Android uh, Xperia Z2. Now, one of the things here's the uh, pull-out headset, earbuds. Hmm. Not bad for the price. Dream Vision. Now, the other ones I've noticed there's a slot or cassette that comes out here where you put your phone in now this particular one just flips open like this which I think is a nicer way of uh, hooking up your phone top 10 free virtual reality apps for iOS and Android choose your experience so anyway I'm really anxious to try this out and I will have to get back to you all on what and 
how this thing works. Anyway, yeah, I'll have to get back to you. I've got my case on here right now. Does this just go like this? Okay, so I'll, I'll tell you right now. One of the things on here, on the other ones, I've noticed there's a clamp here, a retractable clamp. This one doesn't have one. So I guess the phone just sits there, and then you close this shut after. Oh, it's magnetic. That's nice. Got a magnetic latch there. Now, it's, you don't have to be concerned about any scratching on your phone because this part is a soft padded material. And it should be good for your phone. I've got a tempered glass saver anyway, but let's see if this fits in here. Mind you, I have my case. I probably should take off my case because it won't shut with that case on. So let's see what happens here. Probably have to edit all this out. There we go. Center line on screen. Interesting. Oh, there it fits. <laughs> the second, because it says this thing will fit with phones up to six inches. So there we have it. I will play with this. And I know it says you can use your glasses with this, but I just want to see how heavy this feels. Oh, that's not bad. Wow, it gives you. There's like a. <laughs> vibrating feeling so anyway stay tuned and I'll do a little bit of a review on this uh, headset and tell you what I think about it but this right now I can tell you it's pretty comfortable I am really excited to see what this VR stuff's all about thanks for watching